Well, winter storm Denise in our area may have been a snow covered savior for businesses in Wisconsin's North Woods. Snowmobilers in the Marinette County village of Crivets were able to hit the trails. Yeah, they've had to be patient, but with eight inches of new snow in the area, business owners who depend on winter tourism are finally breathing a sigh of relief. Fox 11's Eric Peterson has the story. In the village of Crivets, the sound of snowmobiles fill the air. Now we got snow, we can go. Aaron Jewell is driving his sled to work. Oh, it's a blast. You, you can't beat it, you know. It's, it's, it's a joy. Convenience stores are packed. We just pulled in, we're getting gas. Gonna go get something to eat and then head and check in. Bob and his friends are from Illinois. I'm getting really itchy. I haven't been out in a while. We're ready to go ripping. Jeremy Herzog and his friends spent $20 for fuel. Wherever the trails go, that's where we go. At JC Power Sports, the sales manager sold two snow throwers, an ATV, and more. Just got them delivered a snowmobile today. Uh, guy traded one in, got another one, and now I'm cleaning up his. Just got them cleaning carbs on it, washing it. Put it outside for sale, and we'll probably sell it today or tomorrow, I'm thinking. And the service department is backed up. I've got, I want to say, eight things back here right now. Last week, we only had two. Chris Schrader says this snow already tops last year's effort. If the snow sticks, it's always going to be a better winter for, for any business like this. And people here are thinking snow. Green Bay or Chicago, neither one of them are in the Super Bowl, so I'm going to go snowmobile. In Cribbits, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News. And snow business in Marinette County is big business. Tourism officials say 40% of the county's annual tourism income of $120 million is generated during the winter. That's almost $50 million.